All right, what is up, you guys? And welcome, of course, to another Uber battle. Because that's happened. Um, and then, you know, fuck. <laughs> so, okay, there, it, it's not all that bad. Um, I do see... Um, oh, no, it's horrible. <laughs> it's... Okay. What do I even do? There is no lead that makes sense here for me. Um, I'm gonna lead off with Majin Buu, I think. Um, like, if I'm not destroyed in the next few seconds, I don't know what to do. Um. <laughs> Sometimes I just press record and hope for the best. Sergio, you're an absolute mad lad. <laughs> Alright, so let's see what he Let's see what he leads off with. Um, like and rock. All right, all right, all right. You know he's he taking the um, he's taking the big boy play there. Go in, go in a bit small there. I like that. I can respect that. I'm gonna counter you. Attack me, coward. So I'm pretty sure this is a focus sash for it with um, with endure. So. Um, what I'm going to do is actually just Hyper Beam. Let's see, Stone Edge will do... Ow, oh, okay. First turn crit, I see. You're a pro player, just like me. But yeah, I mean, I clear this sack here. There is nothing to it. Miss? No, not even that. Hmm. It is a bit on the fast side. Because I kind of want to go into this, but no, it gets close combat. So we're going to send in this guy. Tap go and uh, stomach whatever he can throw at me and retaliate. I think Triple Axe is actually in range of KOing anyway. I could have bullet punched, but I don't think I don't think I'm in range for that. Right, withdraws as fair goes to Pokegens.com. Hmm, that looks sounds legal to me. So we're gonna get a pretty cool hit here off. Will the next one kill? No, but no, but <laughs> Jesus, did it did good. 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 Alright, so... This is a golden opportunity to get the scale shot, right? That's, like, that's the play. That's... There is no... Nothing else I want to do from here. I could go for the play of rock polish. But I really want to sack something. That's the easy more important for this. It really isn't. It gets destroyed by everything. I think that's the point. Um, so we're gonna sack you. Because I need my scale shot and I'll I'll go over leaps to get it. Flame for nice. Gonna stomach that. <laughs> nope. So I'm absolutely slower, so my only, like, hope here is that he somehow switches out, try to preserve it, or um, then I take whatever he throws at me with style. Alright, I am faster, cool. So I get my speed race, which is going to be huge. And now I only have one play, and one play only, and that is... Dynamaxing and try to fuck him up. Because at this point, there is no turning back. And if there is, I don't know about it. Everything he has is susceptible to Earthquake. Here comes Zashian. Wait, 
No, it's not an Insplane form, that's a Sword Arc. Doesn't matter, Max Quake. Get my special defense decrease. Race. I'm kind of happy it didn't get um, like a form change. Now I have all the reason to think it could be sashed. And if so, I don't know how much it will do back to me. I am still at minus one, even though I got double HP. Or it could be sashing, but I just don't buy it. Because of the form. But that means... Or what? It was a session. Hey! Cool. <laughs> I just thought it was supposed to look, you know, like a session. No matter. No matter. Eternatus. Ah, you would think so. Yeah, yeah, you call that pressure? I call this beating the living shit out of you, pal. You throw me legendaries and I throw you Crocodile Dynamax and pretty much tell people why this guy should be threatened or threatening. This is not the first time Crocodile broke through. This is the first time it broke through Dynamaxed. So I have a large amount of respect for Crocodile. <laughs> Actually once you know allow it to Dynamax. Okay. So one, one more turn of absolute devastation. And then it's back to smaller devastations. Such as... Oh, will you want to pressure me to... You know, come at me. Oh, he Dynamaxed. So I guess going for Max Darkness was the right call. Not that it could have taken plus two. N nothing takes plus two from anything from Crooked Lock and Pro Adam. I'll, I'll do say this though, and this is more after some usage with Crooked Isle. I've used it with Life Orb, but I feel more and more that um, the extra recall is just not worth it. Crooked Isle is good. Oh. Oh yeah, like everybody following me before, like the the pink aura that comes from Dynamax, I always think mods are like um, sashed every time that happens because I get like an aura that makes the HP ball kind of look like they steal HP. So I'm like, hmm, it lived, but they never do. <laughs> All right, so there goes Lycan Rock. Now we broke its potential sash, which is great. However. Yeah, however, that's it. If it's scarfed, it's going to beat it. Oh yeah, yeah, no problem. And that was that was a sword arc. That was absolutely a sword arc. <laughs> I was kind of waiting on you, buddy. All right, my opponent Sergio, thank you so much for the game. Um, I really don't enjoy using Crocodile like this because I do recognize that it's. If you get it right, you know, it could just break through. Like, the skill chart here is just... It's just one of those things. It looks too much. Unless the opposing Pokemon has, uh, like, Togekiss. There's nothing really stopping this uh, this set. And, uh, yeah, alright. There you go. So, yeah. As always, guys, thank you, of course, for watching. Um, don't believe what's the most broad and variety of Pokemons, but um, yeah, I'll, I'll got my play eventually, and uh, I think this game turned out quite right. So as always, thank you guys for watching, and have a great day everyone. Bye.